Industrial advances have made a major impact in the history of European nations. New inventions such as the water frame, steam engine, steel, and electricity changed not only Europe, but most of the world. Large industries began in Europe in what is known as the Industrial Revolution. This took place toward the second half of the 18th century. Europe saw the industrialization of textile production with the invention of the flying shuttle in the 1730s. John Kay's invention allowed producers to easily and quickly weave as much cotton fabric as was demanded. Shortly after, a machine known as the spinning jenny was invented. The spinning jenny decreased the time needed to produce yarn by spinning multiple spools at once. The water frame was a water-powered machine that created fabric of pure cotton. This invention shifted production of fabric out of the home and into the factory. Other major inventions made serious contributions to Europe's industries, including the steam engine invented by James Watt in the 1760s. This invention was implemented in the transportation of goods as well as operating factories. The development of iron is also important, since iron was used to build machinery and was used in transportation. Ironclad ships and iron machinery were produced as a new alternative to wooden ships and machinery. New techniques for producing iron were introduced in the 1780s. A purer form of iron was produced, which created a better product that could be used in more ways. Iron also became a cheaper product as innovations came about. The agriculture industry was also being improved in this time due to innovations in cultivation equipment. The seed drill was invented by Jethro Tull in the 18th century and improved the accuracy of planting. Other innovations improved the agriculture industry, including crop rotation and new methods of animal breeding. The enclosure of land in England by the landlords allowed the agriculture industry to continue to support a growing population. By the 1830s, Britain was leading in textile production, but other European nations were also advancing industrially. A cotton supply from the Americas benefited European textile industries while the usage of steam engines and new machinery steadily increased. During this time, the railway lines were continually being built, which allowed people to more easily travel from one place to another. Railways also aided in the transportation of goods. In addition to railroads, canals were built and roads were improved. Throughout all of this, the working class family situation did not change much. Each member of the family continued to have the same role. As textile factories grew, however, men became supervisors of the factories and the rest of their family found work elsewhere. By the 1850s, Europe entered what is known as the Second Industrial Revolution. Steel production was increasing more rapidly than before due to the new Bessemer process for making steel, introduced in 1857. This process allowed for the cheap manufacturing of steel in large quantities. Another major industry during this time was in chemical production, namely sulfuric acid and laundry soap. One of the most important inventions in the Second Industrial Revolution was electricity. The first electric power plant came in 1881. Electricity was applied to many facets of everyday life. Furthermore, inventions such as the internal combustion engine in 1885 replaced steam engines and also demanded an oil supply. Oil companies therefore also grew. From the 18th throughout the 19th and into the 20th centuries, Europe has seen major industrial advances, beginning with agriculture and the textile industries, and eventually affecting transportation. New industries including electricity developed and eased the lives of millions of people.